Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 25th of June 2022. It's afternoon here in Bangkok. It's been another hot, hot day as usual. Uh, if you uh, have not tried the Guardian today because you figure it's probably too easy, I would recommend checking it out. It's a, a rather a nice puzzle in the Guardian today and I did pretty well with it as well. <laughs> Better than I sometimes do if it's a tricky puzzle, although I think I got lucky to be honest with you. But anyway, um, yeah, a, a nice game in the Guardian, so uh, today's worthwhile checking it out. If you are not normally into the Guardian, you might want to try it today. Uh, right, so this is the New York Times puzzle, um, and uh, when I see something that looks good and useful, I'll let you know. Um, Okay, so I've seen a 6 blocking across here, and a 6 blocking across here, and a 6 down here, so that's one way to start. We can put a 6 there. We also have 6s going up in this direction, and across row 3 here. So in row 1, right at the end, column 9 is a 6. I don't normally say these column and row numbers because... Uh, they're very confusing on a video, I just normally say this one here, that one there, and hope that you are not visually impaired uh, too much. Uh, and I, also, I try, that's another reason I try to make these Sudokus as big as possible on the screen. Hopefully, if you're watching, if you have a screen that's a wide screen, uh, this is about as big as I can make it uh, on the screen, and you don't have to worry about my face getting in the way either, <laughs> of course. Um, Alright, can't go any further with sixes, but we can get a one now because this one blocks up here and oh, oh sorry, one key held down. There we go, ones are up there, so that's got to be a one. And I see a two and a seven blocking this square here, that means that 2 and 7 must be in these squares, and that means that this square will become an 8. And if this is 2 and 7, then we can work out goes, what goes here, and that is definitely an 8, and 8 and uh, 7, right? So that means, hey, that's not right. Uh, sorry, an 8 and a... <laughs> This is 2 and 7, sorry, 8 and 4, oh, I do apologise, 8 and 4, so 8s will be up there. Um, Oh, look over here, three sevens are nice and close together and makes them easier to spot, I think. So three and seven blocking up in those row, in columns rather, three and seven will be here, right? If this is three and seven, we found ourselves a pair now, so let's see what else we can... Okay, great, we got the one blocking up here, so that has to be the one just there. That's as far as we can go with the ones, though, because ones are going to be left like that. Uh, again, right, what did I say? 3 and 7, so the missing digits are 4, 5, oh look at that, 4 and 5, we've got one of each, 4 there, 5 there, uh, missing from here now, 2 and 8, I can't say which is which just yet, right,
Okay, we've got five blocking across here and across here, so we get our five there. Missing numbers here are um, two, four, and eight. I think. Okay, great, because we got two and four in the same column, so that would be an eight then. Uh, this must be one and three. We got one and three here and here, blocking across these rows, right? Like that. So that's one and three. Uh, this is 2 and 8, so this must be 9 and 7, which means 7 is blocked from here, and we still need a 7 in this column, so that's our 7 then, and we can get the last number here, which I think was a 2, wasn't it? Uh, I see fours and fives. <laughs> They're kind of. Oh, no, I don't. Yes, I do. Yes, I, yes, I did see that. I was right. I thought I did. Fours and fives like this. So block there, block there, and blocked up here. So we've got a pair of four and five up there. Is that going to give us anything useful? Um, oh, yes, because the eight blocks up here and the eight blocks across here. So eight is in one of these two squares. And 8 is one of the missing numbers here, so blocked up there, so that's blocked, so that must be an 8. Two, 2 will be like this. So then, uh, think about this. I'm trying to think about this. This is four and five, right? Two is now blocking up here and blocking across here. So two has to be in one of these two squares. That means two blocks across here and two blocks across here. So that has to be a two, doesn't it? Now this is 4 and 5, so maybe we can check out the missing numbers here, which are the, oh, the same as this, right? 3 and 7. <laughs> 3, 7, 3, 7 there, and no, no, still not, don't know which is which. Uh, down here, and down here. Okay, but anyway, definitely progress here. Now what else is missing from here? 3, 7, 9. We've got the 9s here. Do anything. Let me come back and think about this and see if there's anything else up here. So I said this is four and five, right? Uh, and I know that the ones go there and the twos go here. No, I don't really know much about it, except that they're not in these two squares. Uh, six will be here. Eights will be here. I 
think I've got to look somewhere else now. Um, maybe I this is time to click on the digits. I haven't done that. I mean, to look across the. Uh, ah, now we've got one across. Oh, so I haven't done this to look across the grid. I just, you know, like looking up here. So have, there's a, a one to go there. Now that's going to give us something else because the two is blocked like this. So two is in one of those squares blocking across here. And the two down there, that's got to be a two now. Threes are there, but the fives and the sevens are still unknown, I think. Fives. Seven cannot appear in these two squares, so three, five, and seven must be in these squares, right? So I can at least work out what goes here. Oh, it's going to be the same as this, isn't it? It's going to be uh, two, eight, right? Which is not going to help, is it? Yeah, that's two, eight there. Hmm. Um. So annoying. That's two, eight. Uh, this is the 4, the 5 can still come like this, and the 9 can be like that still. Uh, I was doing, I was, uh, I decided I was going to click on the digits and I started to do that and I found a one and then I didn't go any further, so let's continue because we don't have any completed numbers yet. Uh, of course I know now that two is there and I know that two is here and I know that two is there and two is in fact there, so all the twos are possible locations that have been found, but um, that's not good enough just yet. Threes can go like this. And then here they can go <laughs> anywhere, I think. Well, I know four and five are in these squares, right? So let's just put them up there now. Uh, we have fours here. Fours like that. Fours are here. But fours are still possible like that. Fives are as noted up there. Fives are here. Fives are there. Fives are like this. Sixes have worked out sevens. Um, useful eights.
these trees again. No, I can't see it. Um, okay, I think I'm going to have to go for pencil marks now because I don't know what else to do. So it's pencil mark time for me. Let's put in ones and threes here. Let's put in twos and fours here. Let's put in sevens and nines here. I hope I remembered all that correctly. Let's put in two, uh, sorry, fours and eights here. And let's put in. Uh, what else? This one up here, threes and sevens, of course. Okay, and uh, let's put in the four and five up here. Um, so let's see what else we want. Uh, oh yeah, the ones there. Also the eights here, right? And here, and here. Right, let's go through bit by bit. Ones are okay now. Twos appear in these squares here. And yep, I forgot I said that was a pair of eight or two, didn't I, already? Twos have to appear down here as well. And threes are there and here. Fours can be here. Fives are there, there, um, sixes are in these squares, ah, oh, oh, there we go, there we go, there it is, six one. <laughs> yeah. Uh, of course, it is there's a six-one pair up here now, so this eight is not true. Uh, this will be our eight, and this will be our eight, and this will be our six, and this will not be our, our eight. Uh, six now means that this is the six, and this is the one, and this is the one, and this is the three. Okay, one and six are now complete. Um, right, since I've done that, I might as well just look and see if there's anything else useful. Uh, no, threes, no, not really is there. Four. 
this. I'm going to change this. Sixes down sevens. Yeah, we now have a pair of sevens in those squares. Uh, and because this is left column and right column, left column and right column in the shoot, of course we've got sevens up here. And in fact, of course, there's just two numbers missing from this column now. The other missing numbers in here and here would have to be nine. So then we have a nine block in here, so this would be, be our nine and this would be our seven. And so 7 goes here, and 3 is here. So that's it really. It was just spotting that 6 and 1. As soon as you spotted that 6 and 1, everything else should fall neatly into place. Now we can get the missing numbers here, uh, which are 3 and uh, 9. So we have the 9 block up here. That one will be the 9. This one will be the 3. That's a 3 there. Uh, only a 5 can go... Five can only go here now, and the last number there is a seven. So this will be seven, and this can be deleted. Uh, and this is a seven to finish that block there. The missing number across here is a three, I think. Right, one number missing for this row. We've got two and eight here already, so this has got to be a five. Meaning that's our five, this is our four. Four down here. Two there, uh, this can't be a 5 because 5 is here, so this will be a 5, this is a 4, and this will be a 9 to complete the row, then 9 blocking down here and down here, and the pointing 9 is there, and that's exactly a 9, this hmm, could still be an 8, I, tell, I can't put that in yet, I, there's not, we haven't, I haven't put the candidates in here. I didn't get round to putting in all the candidates, of course, so we've got to be a bit careful here. Um, let's see. Okay, we have two blocking here, and we have two blocking down here, so yes, indeed. That is a two, so this would be an eight. And this is a two, then. Uh, four blocks this square here, so this can't be a four. This must be the 4, and this will be the 8, giving us 4 here, 8 there. And uh, what's left to do? 7 here, put some 9 in this square. 7 there. 9 blocks here, now this will be our 9. 3 is the last number there. 2 goes there, and 3 finishes the game. Okay, so it didn't take very long. Once I spotted, after putting in candidates, I managed to see the 6 and 1 pair. Did not see the six and one pair before filling in the candidates. But so don't tell me <laughs> it's the six and one I need. I saw it, but I saw it too late, right? Okay, that's it. Uh, I'll probably be back later with the LA Times. Bye bye.